All right, guys. Here's the old red paint job on the bus. Been working on this a little bit. Trying to get some of this purple paint off. It seems to be uh, it's dry to the touch, but it clogs the paper up a little bit. So I'm sort of worried about it maybe crawling. So I'm just going to go ahead and uh, get it off and start over. We're going to go red and white with this. This bus was originally red. So I'm taking Musty's one, Musty One's advice, Darren's. You know, he said, uh, what color was it original? And uh, so that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go red and white. I think that'll probably be the best, uh, the best color for resale value, you know? If I want to sell it, people probably don't want a purple bus. They'd probably rather have one, the original color. So we'll go the original on this one. I already got some paint for it that I uh, picked up at a really good deal, some uh, PPG. So that's what we're going to use on this, some single stage. And uh, we'll see how it turns out. We'll go white up top, probably to right about here. And then uh, red, or we might go all the way red. I don't know if I like the white and red. I think I'll just go all the way to the top with the uh, red. And then maybe do the uh, roof red instead of the silver. So uh, got this all knocked out. We got to get it out of here this morning. Got the uh, Cadillac going back. Hang on, let me get some lights in here. And here we go, Cadillac will be going back today. It came out real nice. And uh, it's a no buffer. We didn't get any trash or anything in it. Came out super clean. Got it all on tape last night and it's looking good. So <clears throat> we'll get this out of here. And we got that truck coming. So we got our uh, pickup truck coming today. We're gonna install the flywheel on. And uh, that'll be a pretty cool video. I haven't done any mechanical videos in a while. So uh, here's our new flywheel <clears throat> we picked up yesterday from DeLand Auto Parts. They were, uh, they knew exactly what we needed when we went in there. That's the difference between a real parts store and uh, these other places. Uh, I actually have a, an account at <clears throat> one of the other big stores <clears throat> and uh, sent the customer down there because I didn't want to buy it, you know, I wasn't going to mark it up. and. Uh, they actually had the invoice marked with the proper part, you know, it said small block 400 on the invoice and they gave him a 350 flywheel. And uh, when I called down there to talk to the guy, all he wanted to argue with me, he kept uh, insisting that there was different clock positions that you could mount the flywheel to the back of the crank, you know, make sure that I had it clocked correctly. And uh, I was trying to tell him that there's a counterweight on a small block 400, which he knew nothing about. And uh, finally, when he returned it, one of the old timers told the, the young guy that, yeah, there's a difference. And he, he couldn't believe it. But he just put whatever he wanted on the invoice and uh, gave the customer the part. And if that guy would have taken that home, he would have put it on and uh, gone off of what the invoice said and still had the vibration. So. Here's a little detail, and I knocked this out this morning. It's just a uh, oh, car lot deal, you know. We're gonna knock this out and uh, get it back. This is bought this yesterday from Kia off their uh, trade-in lot, and uh, we'll get this cleaned up and pass it on along to a wholesaler today. So Andrea's got a deal with Kia where she can buy their uh, trade-ins. So that's what. Uh, these get swapped from, you see them come from Kia. But anyway, I got a poster here, I haven't checked it out. Let's go ahead and see what it is. And uh, I might have a few of these to uh, send out. I know I still owe Jeremy a poster. I got his uh, in the house, some of those with the Camaro on them. And uh, I gotta start getting some of that stuff out to you guys. Uh, also have the uh, epoxy for the etch primer kit. And uh, I need you to PM me your address so I can send that to you. Uh, this looks like a you know, generic poster with some cars on it there. Got some nice cars on there. And it's got a Scion on there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I painted a Scion like that. It's all green though. No, uh, no silver. Well, there you go. So if anybody wants one of these, got a nice bagger on it. I only have a, uh, is it one? One poster? Oh, I got one of these, I guess. 
So maybe I'll just hang it up so I don't start a war or I'll randomly send it to somebody. Yeah, maybe I'll do that. Somebody that I have an address to. Anyway, so that's what's going on today. Not a whole lot. Everybody's running late today because uh, Hans uh, hung out with his buddy yesterday and they didn't get home until 1 o'clock in the morning. So it was a big day for him, I guess. He hadn't seen his friend in a long time, so that's always cool when his buddy comes from Alabama. I guess they're on spring break. And uh, they all went turtle watching last night. So, so that's pretty cool, I guess, if you're into that kind of thing. So, so another uh, beautiful day here. A couple fluffy clouds. Got some uh, leaves coming in on the old maple trees here. I don't know. I think that's what this is. And I uh, got the new leaves coming in. It's the last old one to fall off there. It's been hanging in on the very top. So, uh, so yeah. I got the beetle out yesterday and did some more buffing on that. So we're going to do some more videos. Hopefully I can get this damn thing bolted together. Uh, of course, it's on the other side of the, uh, the fence here in the backyard under that shed. So we'll uh, hopefully get that finished up. I got to bring it around and paint some uh, bed liner on it. Here comes the kitty army. Meow, meow, meow. What's up, guys? Mm -hmm. meow, meow, meow. You guys hungry? Huh? You guys want to eat and the dogs want to go for a car ride? Mm hmm. Yep, dogs want to go for a ride. Maybe we'll do that. But anyway, I got to uh, talk to a YouTuber yesterday. That's always good. And uh, good conversation, that was cool. And I want to apologize to the guys that were in town for bike week that I didn't get to, uh, I didn't get to stop by, man. I just wasn't feeling good. And uh, I was in recovery mode, so I apologize. And uh, maybe next time you're in town, uh, you can get by and check us out. But uh, that was the first person that's ever called and wanted to come by and Andrea said, well, you know, probably wouldn't be a good day. But uh, I had a couple bad days in a row there. A uh, little procedure didn't go very well last time. So I'm sort of recovering from that, you know, getting my legs back and stuff. And uh, we get back into the video making thing. So I'm sure a couple of you guys out there are glad that I wasn't feeling good and couldn't make videos, but I'm back now. So I'll be pushing the record button and uh, making some more videos. So uh, until the next time that they uh, jack me up, which is two weeks from now, I'll be making the videos. Cat finally got the big ass dragonfly that was in here. So one thing I don't have a lot of is big dragonflies and uh, rats. No mouse, no mice, no uh, no varmints at all around here with these cats. Is it good? Is that good? Because he was flying around here last night, hitting the fluorescent lights. Oh, I came out here last night, and there was a spider on this wall as big as my hand. Mm-hmm. No shit. I should have killed it, but I've seen videos on YouTube where the big spiders like to jump on you, so I just passed on that and uh, let it slide. But he's living in here somewhere. Somewhere. Uh, he might have been what happened to this thing, too because it was alive last night. But anyway, let me uh, turn the camera off. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Tom Duncan, just wanted to say thank you to you. Uh, you asked me when I, uh, you were here, I got that birthday card from you, and I did see the birthday card briefly before you got here, but uh, I know that uh, you and Shevaholic got hijacked there by Holly, and you met Holly, so you understand. But anyway, I found your card in Holly's room the other day, and I really want to say thanks for the, the kind words that you put in the card. And uh, it's guys like you is the reason I make videos. So, uh, you know, for every couple of, uh, you know, guys that, you know, don't like them, there's guys like you that do like them. And I'm glad that the videos, uh, you know, that you get something from them. And uh, it was really cool spending some time with you and your daughter when you were here. So uh, thanks again for the card, buddy and uh the kind words and uh yeah so it's really cool having you and uh your daughter here and it's cool watching her work on her car and stuff and making videos and 
all that cool stuff so i was thinking about you guys the other day when we were having barbecue i was going to get you some of that sweet sauce you like but uh i didn't have no flow so i'll pick you up a bottle of that and send it your way though for sure some of that barbecue sauce that you like oh yeah there and andy andy you know when he was here he told me about the uh the youtube videos uh what is it trailer park boys so i've uh, filled my head with about you know 20 hours of that crap now thanks andy appreciate that one so uh if you guys haven't checked that out they're freaking hilarious go uh check that little uh youtube deal out i don't know if it's a youtube deal or if it's an actual tv show in canada or what but uh Canadian Catalyst was telling me about it when he was here and I just started checking it out when I wasn't feeling good and it was pretty cool watching those. I got some good laughs. So, all right, let me chew the, uh, the shuffle, get the door open, get the cars moving, move this, uh, clean this up. Got another one coming for a clean up after this one. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to run into town and get some, uh, spray some stuff you know the slickum stuff for the tires and the plastic and the motors and stuff we're out of uh, detailed materials because uh andrea likes to use it all but not replace it you know one of those kind and then when you don't have it she's like well why are we out but anyway guys have a great day push the record button and uh we'll see you a little later